Welcome back to the Goons Podcast. <laughs> you are in the ninth dimension. You are no longer living. The seventh layer of hell. <laughs> It oh. is almost Halloween, guys. Yeah. Oh, my God. Well, I feel like we shouldn't Halloween theme an episode now because we're like three weeks it's away. It's fall. We are. It's fall yeah. time. Time to fall you know what this down is, though? like you don't have legs. This is our 50th episode. It is? Is it actually? Yeah. Oh. Wow, that's dude. Sad. I'm surprised we made it this far. That is 50 Me missed too. paychecks that's now. 50? That is. I would say man. that's 50 weeks, but it's probably like a year and a half. <laughs> so yeah. when does it when does it actually reach the point of slavery? <laughs> it's about yeah, 115. When do we cross that line? When, that when, do we, when do we call the labor board and like figure out what's going on here? <laughs> These shackles are getting uncomfortable. <laughs> You're a funny man. You're a funny yeah. man. Yeah. You want to things. tell people why you couldn't be here uh, last week? I figured you I guys talked about it because I got like I 40 even... comments of people saying we did not talk on. about you at all. I don't even remember no. where you were. Where were you? What? There's no way you guys didn't talk about it because I got a bunch of comments saying turn your power back on. Oh right, your power oh, went out. Oh, we might have. Yeah, that's we right. Mentioned it then. Yeah. 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 Okay. Well then, yeah, I just don't really power, think about you. So in my, yeah, I guess while I was asleep, my power reset itself, and my com- I I usually always leave my computer on, and I guess when it reset, it just like fried my power supply. Because I put mm-hmm. my old, I put my old power supply in, and it started working right away. So yeah, I don't know, weird. Are you using your old power supply? Is it enough for your PC or is your fried yeah my power old PC supply. was uh, yeah it was just, I think it was the same size as, as my new oh, one. Yeah, that's good eating. Yeah. Fried, fried power supply. <laughs> yeah, it's better when you better than baked. Yeah, yeah, but it's less healthy. You get all those fats, and carbs. Good. Yeah, love fat. All eight hundred watts of fat. <laughs> mm. That was hundred calories per watt. That's a lot of calories. Eight hundred. You getting fat, for one, son? One fried <clears throat> power supply. Mm-hmm. Blarg, I got a question. Soup. I got an answer. You were eating goldfish before we started. Yes, like the the food, like the do you not, not, do not you... the kill, children's thing. <laughs> <laughs> the children's thing. Yeah, like you know, kids they like both goldfish. Oh, I was, I was, eat raw goldfish. Yeah, I was like, what ch- what fucking child eats raw goldfish? You been spending some time in like China or something? Ones that wear helmets, probably. <laughs> yeah. mm. <laughs> what kind were you eating? Were you just eating regular? Ex- no, the extreme cheddar ones. Hmm. Yeah. You're you're usually on the extreme side of things. Hey, now true. what do you now like, what do you mean by that? It, uh, like especially is, like religions and Islamic beliefs. <laughs> yeah. Extreme sports. <laughs> I guess that's one way to put it. Were you did you just ask me that just so you could say that? <laughs> did you really actually did, 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 That was a good setup actually. Get on. So much lore just to just to just to make a a, a false claim about me. Uh, I love going out of my way to make up lies about you guys. <laughs> yeah, he spent the whole last podcast insinuating that I was a Nazi. <laughs> oh yeah, he like did the do entirety that. Entirety of it. I forgot yeah. about that. Oh, I God. mean, you still yeah. haven't corrected him. Anyway, I, was, <laughs> oh, I will when it's a, still, when it's a lie. I'll correct it. Still haven't <laughs> denied that. Okay. I was asking. I was asking. Uh-huh. Who was, I was not a Nazi? Are there any like? Uh, Snacks or foods that you guys are like nostalgic about? Do you know it's like fucking horse shit? <clears throat> oh, uh, zebra cakes, pop tarts, <laughs> zebra cakes. Oh, don't, <laughs> what do you mean? You don't little, laugh at that. Have you ever had a zebra cake? <laughs> you little fucking. I've never even had the chance to try to eat a zebra's ass. Zebra's cake, or, zebra's <laughs> zebra's cake is ass. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Say that weirdly. Yeah, well, they also they also make like a little dessert too. Those are pretty good as well. Uh, I thought zebra cake was a dessert. Yeah, what do you mean? What is zebra yeah. cake? The asshole of a zebra. <laughs> no, but they You those, say a lot of gay cakes, things, boy. Those cakes are fucking bomb though. <clears throat> so good. Nasty. I, I'm waiting to hear uh, your answer because I feel tarts. like you're about to drop some bombshell pop tarts. I used tarts. to love pop tarts as a kid and they're fucking terrible. Just <gasps> Any pop tarts, dude? Any of them? <laughs> <laughs> oh! Did you ever have toaster tarts? I can't tarts? tell if you're disgusted think... with them or if you're coming. 
<laughs> it's always a fine line, and then <laughs> can't believe you'd settle for that. Well, I was seven. Okay, seven year olds eat dirt. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe you did. I don't know. Yeah, did I you didn't... ever have toaster tarts, McNasty? Toaster, toaster tarts or toaster tarts? toaster tarts? It's what like the, the rip off pop tart. Mm. No, oh. I've had like That's store like value. store brand. A great value. Yeah, it's like, like a pop tart, but imagine you know, like if you have a pop tart in your pantry uh-huh. and it sits there for like half of a year, <laughs> you know okay. how it tastes. Yeah, like yeah, yeah that, that's how a toaster that's tart. A, kinda a brand tastes. new toaster tart. Yeah, that's like <laughs> that's pretty disgusting. <laughs> we should let a toaster tart sit around for six months and eat one, dude. I bet that like unlocks some new levels. <laughs> <laughs> you just open your drawer and there's just like a portal to another dimension. <laughs> <laughs> Portal to Brazil. <laughs> Portal Bring toaster to strudels to Brazil or toaster tarts. <laughs> toaster strudel dimension. I like the nacho lunchables, dude. That was my shit. I don't think oh, I've ever had a nacho one. Some lunchables. Dude, I had the the ham. So dude, looking back, those ham ones were so nasty. You could like, oh yeah. you like let them sit in your lunchbox for like three months, and they look identical to that when you put them in there. It tastes the same. Isn't this They're supposed just like to be rubber? Isn't that supposed to be something that we used to like, but we know now is trash? It's the little kid MRE, dude. That's all it is. The Pretty little much. kid MRE. <laughs> dude, I still like the pizza bizarre, ones. Yeah. The lunch, dude, I always yeah, ate the pizza, the pizza one. ones cold. Same. I, I just recently learned that you're supposed to warm them up. With really, what? Bro? You're at school. Yeah, you're yeah. supposed to put them in like a little microwave, dude. I didn't know that either. I was like, dude, I've been eating them Bro, cold for like no sh- I never, 20 years. Yeah. No shot never they could put a up. fucking microwave in a kid's classroom. They'd be putting gerbils and shit in there. There's no way you could have that. <laughs> Making them a little gerbil cuisine. <laughs> oh, 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 what? The only lunchable I've ever <laughs> really liked is just like the turkey cheddar ones. Those are really like, only good ones. They're not good. That's the thing is they're all horrible. Oh, I'm saying the only ones that I've ever like, Bruh, I guess any, tolerated, not really yeah. enjoyed. Any turkey in a lunchable has got to be vile. <laughs> I don't know. See, the nacho ones weren't eating, that dude. bad because it's just chips. Yeah. Like yeah. it's just like little chips yeah. and salsa and cheese. Yeah, not that much going on. Yeah, the cheese is a little cursed, but. You know, <laughs> it's pretty fucking cursed. It's a little cursed. <laughs> but it, it could be worse. It is nostalgic though. I will occasionally uh, get them <clears throat> at the store. Do, do they, uh, do they make Dunkaroos anymore? Yeah, I but saw them the other day. You can get them on Amazon. Station. You can get really? them on Amazon all day. I feel yeah, like I, I just like... have not seen one in a store for like years. <clears throat> hmm. I've never had one. A Dunkaroo? Either. It's just a. It's just it's like just a diabetes. It's like dipping an, it's like an Oreo sweet. that's not put together. No, it's, it's like, like throwing like... a kangaroo into a basketball goal. It's similar. <laughs> you mean a hoop? <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> Yeah, what yeah, is, I can what really is, see wrong, the wrong skin there. color. What is a basketball. kid's food that you guys still eat? Kraft mac and we, cheese. We, uh, tit milk. Okay, no. Blark, absolutely mac fucking cheese. not. Kraft mac and cheese is not l- limited to yeah. No, Kraft is the superior mac and cheese. No, it is not. Race. Velveeta shells all day, every day. Fuck you. No, no. absolutely Those fucking are good too. not. Kraft all day. They're just, good. Kraft is just this powdered though. grossness. I don't know. It's not, I don't like it. Powdered grossness. Fuck off. Oh, good. God, I can't believe crap mac and cheese. Oh, disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> no, actually, I fucking lived off that shit for a while. Crap mac and cheese really? and hot dogs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't like the hot wow, dogs. You're a piece of shit. Just day dude. in and day out, crap mac and cheese, dude. <laughs> Three, Three meals lunch a day. Dude, I used to be extremely broke, okay? I was living off fucking food we, stamps. <laughs> we survived through the recession on that powdered cheese. <laughs> I will say, dude, when you, if you warm up Kraft in the microwave, bro, that shit's like, mm-hmm. it's like Minecraft, Mac, dude. That shit's Wait, all blocky what? and stuck together. M- mm. Have you ever just had, like, it? homemade mac and cheese? Yeah, Danielle makes it yeah. all the time. Oh, man. It's fucking so good. delicious. Yeah, I, just, I like Kraft better, dude. I don't know. Really? I, I, it's like, yeah, because you always know what you're going to get, you know? <laughs> it's like a three-legged hooker. Unlike a box of chocolates. Yep. <laughs> I don't know what you're gonna get. <laughs> nice reference. Yeah. Hmm. Nice. What's uh what's what's one food that's <laughs> super popular that you guys just fucking hate? Like just cannot eat. Um uh, that's a good question. I think mine is is 
hot dogs. I don't even <laughs> mind the taste, but just knowing that I'm eating like a pig's hoof and pussy. I'm just <laughs> I don't. See, that, want, I don't it depends. Want. I mean, that's incentive. That's enti- yeah, that entices me. More. It yeah. depends. There are hot dogs that are made not like that, like kosher, or like all beef hot dogs. <laughs> that's the ones I eat. Yeah, I don't like tomatoes. If you eat like dude. A, a sixty-nine cent pack of hot dogs, yeah, you're you're eating fucking. Oh, who knows what you're the eating fuck? Just yeah, like, you're, you're literally just eating carcinogens at that point. Yeah, exactly. But no, they make they make good. You just got to spend the money to get the. The good ones. Yeah, I'll like and force extra myself. Dollar. <laughs> it's the extra dollar. Yeah, the dollar sixty nine cents. <laughs> Got to splurge a little. Bit. Now, if you get like Hebrew Nationals, those are like sometimes. five or six bucks a pack. They are not cheap. Well, are they hot like, dogs or are they uh, like sausages? No, they're, they're hot dogs. Sausages, like, I fuck with. Hebrew those. National like, hot dogs. Okay, wait. Did you say yeah. Hebrew National hot dogs? Hebrew National, because they're like kosher. What is it? What even is kosher? Um, it's like uh, it's just. Uh, I don't know. Yes, he doesn't know what kosher is. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of like the same thing as like halal. It's like it, it has to be like well, pure. It means they can halal. consume them. Okay, what yeah, is, like, I'm gonna I'm gonna find out with kosher. It is can't before. be from like an animal that's just like gross and just treated terrible. I, don't I know. always thought kosher has something to do with pickles. I always hear people like, "Yeah, this food's kosher." <laughs> not, you did not make that out of pickles. Well, Any food pickles. that complies with strict set of dietary rules in Judaism. Yeah. What yeah. does that mean? It means they can eat them. So I think that the, pork, the animal right? that they make it out of is like um, animals it has to be like, that it has have to be like taken care moves. of. No, it uh, has so to why have... do the Jews care about pickles so much? <laughs> I don't think pickles have split hooves. They're probably no. Okay. There's something going on there with the Jewish people because you know they want to get everyone circumcised. Everything's got to be kosher. Okay, let's they're not some, go down this road, Sue. They're please. on some pickle shit. <laughs> You know what's Let's, you know what's fucking wild? Start blaming Jew- Jews for things. You know what's <laughs> w- Jewish up. people can't have New York uh, tap water because there, there's there's technically <laughs> there is technically shrimp living inside of New York tap water. Hey baby, I'm gonna take you out for some seafood tonight. Turns on the tap. <laughs> yeah, there is like millions of millions of like water. microscopic shrimps in. New York uh, tap water, so they can't they can't have New York tap. Honestly, water. Honestly, though, that's it's also not vegan. Good. That's kind of good though, because you could just like get protein from drinking water. Do you drink enough of it? Oh. You don't even need to eat. I don't know what the protein levels of like microbial shrimps are, but dude, that <laughs> can't be that. That's much, awesome. Bro. You could just drink like a gallon of water a day and just eat like a head of lettuce, dude. You'd be a fucking maniac. <laughs> just be yeah. a shredded fucker in New York, all shrimped up. Yeah, that's uh, I learned that <laughs> that's recently. Up. That's uh, a fun fact about New York. It's like a SpongeBob episode n- title, <laughs> all shrimped up. <laughs> was yeah. there ever shrimp in SpongeBob? Yeah. Uh, was there? I think I never encountered uh, shrimps. I think there was one shrimp because I remember the picture. Let me see it. SpongeBob shrimp. You're gonna find some curse shit right now. Yeah, just like his penis all shriveled up. <laughs> <laughs> Can you post a picture of the SpongeBob shrimp? I'd like to see him. Absolutely, my dear. Ew. Oh yeah, I remember. Ew. I remember Why does he look like that? He's a shrimp. Yeah, dude. All the That's other characters look like. like look cute, and then the shrimp is just like <laughs> fucked oh, and disturbing. Just a monstrosity. <laughs> a normal looking yeah. shrimp with like a fish that looks like a businessman next to him. Like they bother trying to give the fish a personality, but the shrimp is just. A regular shrimp with a t-shirt on. His tail looks like his dick. <laughs> I feel like shrimps are just dick. Yeah. They're little sea roaches. I feel like they're all yeah, I dick. I fucking love shrimp. Though. I had shrimp yesterday. Shrimp fajitas. All dicked Same, up. Dude. Fucking, oh, like just, there's so Bro, many different ways a, you can make shrimp, too. Yeah. Dude, there's a restaurant in Toronto called Harbor 60. And I went there recently and got the... the we got like a seafood tower and shit. And the shrimp that were on there... Bro, they they were huge. Like, I I don't even know what to compare mm-hmm. them to. Like jumbo shrimp. Uh, I've seen like, shrimp yeah, like but, before. Yeah, but but they're like fucking the the size of like a New York them strip. steroid shrimp, baby. Like a New York strip steak <laughs> size shrimp. Really? They're fucking massive little fuckers. Like it's not little. Yeah, you like you got to eat with like a fork and knife over like a five minute period because there's so much goddamn shrimp. Hmm, that sounds good. Holy shit. Yeah, they they absolutely bang though. So highly, highly recommend if you want a big ass shrimp in Toronto, Harbor 60 got some big shrimps. Would you guys ever go out like on a fucking tugboat? 
Your, what? Your, your mic. Your mic. Your mic. Dying while somebody's out. jerking you off. Uh-huh. Your, your, your <laughs> mic cut out at tug. Would you guys ever go out for a tug? No, would you guys ever go on a fucking like Actually, like yes. a tug boat or something? I mean, uh, yeah, like, or like a boring. shrimping boat or something. Would you ever go if if I, I'm with some friends or something? I don't know. Just just me and the, the boys are it. going out on a tugboat <laughs> <He and> today. <laughs> See y'all in like three months. <laughs> me and the boys, I'm gonna go watch a boat. Me and the boys pull going a different shrimping. boat. So I'll see you later. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, we should do it. We should all do a vlog where we go out and like deep sea fucking. I don't know, dude. Something on. Shut up, bitch. I'm going to my tug. <laughs> We're gonna do some deep sea tugging <laughs> together. Yeah, we should go out like fucking. Uh, what, what's that show where they're like fucking shrimping and catching lobsters and all that shit? Deadliest Catch. That's the one. I, no. Seinfeld. Deadly, that's not. Seinfeld. The Forrest office. Gump. <laughs> Crab TV. <laughs> 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 I don't know, man. I don't MTV know. crabs. I don't know. Lobster Wars. That is not <laughs> Lobster, Lobster Wars. Wars. Maybe it is Deadliest Catch that I'm thinking of. Yeah, Deadliest Catch. They yeah, they caught like a lot of stuff. I always thought and Deadliest things. Catch was uh. I would hope. So. No, no, it is Deadliest Catch. Yeah, do we Sounds should like do some shit like that. Deadliest they should Catch have us could also be episode. about STDs. <laughs> I would probably cry, just out of pure uncomfort. Dude, I would so be down <laughs> to do like a goons themed deadliest catch episode. <laughs> Except let's just go to like Fiji and have a sailboat and catch like Nah dude, I wanna go up. out on some bullshit. Right. <laughs> I'm not trying to go to like <clears throat> northern Alaska waters or like the dude, Bering yes. Strait. <laughs> I want some big ass cold fucking waves. We're gonna I want die. It to be hell. So you I just want to be miserable, miserable for like a month. Why do you want to be saying. miserable? Because it would be great content for everyone to watch. <laughs> or we could just like rent a cottage and sit on a beach instead. <laughs> Have fun. Nah, <laughs> dude. We got to go out and catch a big fucking bluefin tuna, man. Oh, my God. Aren't tunas like, like 600 pounds? pounds? Are they? Yeah. <laughs> yeah they're fucking huge. Yeah. Yeah, dude, you get a, fish are expensive though. You catch something dude, like some, that, you get a certain, good, you get a good tunas, amount of money from that. Certain tunas are extremely expensive. Yeah, because of sushi. Bluefin tunas are, uh, I think they're like the most expensive. If you catch a big one, you can get some good money from that. Yeah, it's because sushi. Like certain places yeah. will pay a shit ton of money because well, they're gonna make their money back on it. Yeah. Yeah, mm-hmm. I think I'll just do a raid ad and not all of that for. Yeah, money. me too. Yeah. yeah, but the fucking like just adrenaline. No. From Catching pulling in a big ass tuna shrimp. or a fucking One lobster, shrimp. dude. Going to the Bering Strait and risking my life to catch and shrimp. I want to see one. dude go one on one with a fucking lobster, just like balling out. The thing fucking... would probably pull me into the water. <laughs> one on one with a lobster. <laughs> I just want to see dude like backed into a boxing? corner and this fucking lobsters come at him and dude's like stuck like throwing, pissing and shitting, everywhere. throwing hands with him and shit. <laughs> yeah. Mm. That sounds uh yeah. that sounds like something I'll, I'll watch you guys do and I'll pass on. Oh no, you're coming, Canadian. You're coming. I you'd I be really, used I to really the don't. cold. I uh, it's it, yeah, bro, you'd be immune. It does not get very cold where I live. It is still like eighty degrees right now where I live. Nah, not... you'd be used to it. <laughs> nah, you know, you're immune. You'd be all up <laughs> there like batting down the hatches. Do. Shit. Yeah, I, I I don't know. I do have my boating license though. So that's something. Okay, well then you're you're coming to drive the boat. I'll drive the boat. Sure. Let me let me that that be my job. I get to sit inside, drink coffee, drive the boat, watch you guys die outside, not do anything about it. <laughs> See, it's a win-win. It's a win, fucking win. <laughs> Never have to do a podcast again, and I get to drive the boat. We, we could go on. What what show would you guys want to go on? Like a reality show. If we had to pick one to all go on, what would what would y'all go? Probably on? Probably keeping up with the, Kardashians. Yeah, that's what I was about to say. The one with the Kardashian <laughs> skanks. I just want to fuck the shit out of Caitlyn Jenner. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> I just want to get a butt lift. <laughs> I just want to eat Kanye's ass out. Okay, that's relatable. <laughs> I just want to suck Kanye's big black cock. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like Kanye he, he, he is one of those. No, like, he's, I feel like Kanye has a very basic dick. He's e- yeah, you, you can so? Google his wiener. He's emailed it to woman. Oh really? Oh yeah. Like he even has like a lyric about it, and uh, I think it's Runaway. Yeah, he, he 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 emailed a picture of his hog, and uh, yeah, it's it's like just a normal 
Normal email. <clears throat> yeah, can you imagine emailing email somebody your a dick? dick? Did you guys ever you see gotta on a, a, you got to be on a mission. Who's the guy that plays dick. Captain that's America? That's a lot of work. Yeah, Chris Evans when he's scrolling Chris through Evans. Instagram and he's like, oh, there's my hog. <laughs> he like showed his fucking dick on the Instagram story. <laughs> that fucker was huge, too. <laughs> he was well, a yeah, fucking he's horse Captain America. <laughs> horse meat ding dong. That's America's <laughs> cock, baby. Horse meat ding dong. <laughs> It was like all over. Tw- I remember like people were. Uh, it was like trending on Twitter, and it was just like all women replying to it. God, you guys need to relax. Well, yeah, of course, you harlotans, McNasty. I could see you on like Love Island or something. Oh, oh. God, dude, did y'all watch that show? show and I want to kill myself. It's the worst <laughs> fucking. Uh, it is actually horrendous. Uh, I hate those kinds of shows. A bunch of retards, dude. Literally, they don't. They don't even know what's going on. It's yeah. fucking awful. I hate it. You want to feel bad about, like, millennials in that generation? Watch that show. Or if you want to feel good about yourself, watch that. You want to feel good about and yourself? just know yeah. that <laughs> you will never reach that low. That those we'll sign McNasty up for The Bachelor. <laughs> I, I would just quit. <laughs> like, <Yeah>. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> no thanks. Yeah. I feel Dude, like you, you just... could go into Mass Singer because you don't show your face. And then, I and then you have to unmask face. yourself, yeah. Mm. He unmasks. He's just completely black faced with a question mark. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it was Justin Trudeau. <laughs> uh, yeah, I uh, I don't think it would matter because no one knows what I look like anyway. Yeah. So yeah, you could like unmask yourself and just be like, and people what? Be like, oh, who the who the fuck that Is guy? This I kind of forgot what you look like guy? to be honest. Think of think Go of ahead. white guy named like Dave. No, you're more of like... You know what? You're an Eric. You really are an Eric. You are an Eric, yeah. It's a me. Yeah, you, you look like an Eric. Like, if I had to guess, <sighs> I'd say that's oh. an Eric. Who looks like more of an Eric? Me or McNasty? No, Mc, McNasty Eric. looks like a fucking Kyle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like, like, yeah. Yeah, you're full Kyle. Family guy pajamas to school. South Park <laughs> t-shirt. <laughs> I was thinking McNasty looked more like a, a Linda. Mo- a monster hat. Linda? <laughs> you look like a shell. Cookie monster t-shirt. <laughs> what the fuck does that even mean? You, you kind of look like a something. Miranda. Yeah. You look like Miranda Cosgrove to oh, me. Oh, <laughs> I would fuck McNasty. You guys need to seek therapy. <laughs> Says McNasty. <laughs> <laughs> I've sought therapy Blarg, before. you should go on Queer Eye. <laughs> Why is that? <laughs> I just think you'd do good on that show. I don't know. I, isn't that the whole point to like have people who dress like complete fucking horse come and then the queers are like, hey, mm-hmm. you know, here's how you look like a presentable <clears throat> human being and not. Yeah, that, you like could the help them like you could help people look better. Oh, so I'm on. I'm, a, I'm, I'm one of the queers. OK. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> OK, <laughs> cool. Yeah, that's fine. Sure. They seem like nice guys. A little over the top for me, but, you know, that's all right. And I. I'd, I'd I be a part isn't of that, that show? Course. That show's fucking old. I haven't seen it in a long time. It's like two years old. Wasn't it two. like a pandemic show? Or is yeah, it... you don't really seem like they're like core demographic, McNasty. I... <laughs> I just mean <laughs> like what? <laughs> that doesn't really seem like something <laughs> you want. When you're, when you're young, to laugh at when you're young and you grow up with two sisters and a mom, you you watch gay shows. It's just it happens. <laughs> it's not stuff that I would sit in my room. Did and you watch, watch my like own. Property Brothers? Like yeah, all that sh- a lot of oh. HGTV shows. Oh, Fuck dude, the only thing I ever let my that. sister watch was me undress. Good. <laughs> Again, seek therapy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm signed with McNasty Again, on that one. Kyle. No, not seek. <laughs> dude, come on. <laughs> you are not helping the narrative that we built last <laughs> podcast. I just wanted to slip that in under the rug real quick. Yeah, that that was hmm. like not at under the that was like at the front door with a yeah. sign on it. <laughs> ah, my dick! I'm sorry. Did you just fall your out of your shorts. <laughs> <laughs> Onto the hardwood. Yeah, the, back the, in. The, the, like old, the old rope fell off. It was hold it to my leg. No, I dropped my controller and me knob. You got a sling for your cock. <laughs> Damn, son. <laughs> cock sling. Don't knob it till you try it. Don't. Don't knob Again, what? A therapy. <laughs> <laughs> I got some questions here. Do okay. you? Uh, in, oh, in the comment section, if you oh, guys no. would like to hear. 
Wow. No, I want to talk Topics about Topics for next knob podcast knob. because you idiots can't make your own. Yeah, that's that checks what? out. That's about right. Mm-hmm. Uh, I don't know what these say, but I just seen them, so I'll just read them as we go. <laughs> that sounds dangerous. <laughs> New editor, get Since ready to the work. Quality <laughs> of games right now is not great. What would you do if you could take charge of any game studio? Uh, would you improve upcoming games with ideas that make it fun, such as Force Game Chat and COD? Or would yes. you want to have and create a whole new game? If so, what game would you create? Take Black Ops 2 and create a and game push like it that somewhere now. else. <laughs> push it to 2021 and add forced game chat so that people can call me slurs and say they fucked my mom again, like the old days. Yes. Make COD fun again. They should make it a requirement it's, to have a microphone in some yeah. games. Uh, at least in, in some search, game mode. Just in search. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, in search. <laughs> it's all masculine. I feel for. like in search it needs forced game chat. Like, I don't know. Mm-hmm. It just It just adds to it so much. Like honestly, like I what game was it where uh, was it Black Ops Two where like it had force game chat, but then when you died, you could hear the other team too, and not the people that are still yes, alive. Yeah, yeah, dude, that's like yeah. perfect. Yep. Yeah, because that's when they start the slur started flying. That's and when stuff. the content comes. Yeah, baby. exactly. Even, I miss yep. making trolling videos on Call of Duty. Dude. Like, that was some of the most mm-hmm. fun shit. But even before yep. being a content creator, like even before that's like ooh that's content. Like you're thinking you're like I feel like it was just fun, like making yeah. friends and oh, getting, enemies. Well, yeah, getting you know, reactions actually, out of people is like one of the best, funniest things you can do. I think uh, I think lobbies need to stay together in COD again. Like, they, uh, that, yes, that as that's well. The, they, they literally, they took out like the Force game chat and they're like, how can we make this even shittier? Okay, let's make it so that you can never play with the same team ever again. Well, yeah. they're trying to make it less toxic, worst, but like... Worse idea. Well, who wants that? Nobody. I don't that? know. Nobody. That's... Everyone that plays COD like, is, is see, fucking like deranged. These studios want to pander to kids is the thing. And it's like, your game's 18 plus. Yeah, they're, yeah like, they're, literally. Like, yeah. You shouldn't pander to <laughs> yeah, fucking true. kids. I, I want to hear about all the men that my mom has slept with <laughs> when I play COD. Exactly. There's so many of them. Yeah. I have so around. many dads. I'm trying to reconnect <laughs> with them. <laughs> yeah. I would fix Siege. No, you wouldn't. I would it's make not, Siege fun fixable. again. It's it's would, just this, not fixable. I would make it fun again. If I could. How what would, would you, you do? do that? Um mm. I don't know. Nervous nervous <laughs> fart. Well, I know uh, the reason it didn't really affect us, but I know the reason that a lot of people quit siege is because the cheating got really it's boring. bad. Well, that's a problem in Cheating got well, terrible nowadays. They I think they they like my issue with it is they pandered way too much to the competitive side and not the casual oh, yeah. side at all like the the like there should always be some sort of ltm in that game like to keep casual players enjoying it like what does even LTM if it's mean? goofy like limited Little time mode, like, time so like you know like the deagle mode or like shotguns only or like oh, something yeah. always happening to like keep the game fresh rather than just like uh-huh gay airplane yeah that kind yeah of i remember uh and make when, new maps instead of fucking up the already good maps it, yeah that, that was yeah. the worst new thing. maps cold yeah. war actually had gun game for like a couple days and that actually was a lot of fun considering the game overall was dog oh, shit yeah. i miss gun those game, kinds of games game like so so the old fun. cods the gambling ones like oh, one in the yeah. chamber Did you guys ever gamble on uh on black ops yeah yeah, yeah, yeah gambling was fun like cod points. i really liked that <laughs> I bet you did, of buddy. You, did. you Indian slut. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> you mother yucking. Add gambling to games. Add game chat. Dude, I used to fucking love together. Uh, One in the Chamber. That was like one of my favorite game oh, modes. That, yeah, one was, that fun. was super yeah, fun, too. Yeah, that was fun as fuck. <clears throat> like, why don't they have those anymore? It's just like Team Deathmatch or Search and Destroy. Dude, Suda's like One in the Chamber videos and shit or, what, or uh, gun game videos. Dude, his videos were amazing. Bro, I, I, I remember watching PewDiePie's, I think it was his thousand or his hundred sub special and he was playing fucking One in the Chamber Black Ops. <laughs> Oh, man. Oh, I think I know what you're talking about. That video gets, like, recommended every once in a while. Really? Yeah, it'll just, like, it's like one of those videos. I haven't watched that since, like, I don't know, probably, like, fucking 2012 or whatever the fuck it was like. You'll look at it, and it'll it'll say, like, 10 years (sighs) ago, and you're like, why is this being recommended to me? (laughs) We should play Black Ops 2 for a video, like, sometime soon. I got on not long ago because I was trying to do some some guitar reactions uh, for for the the memes for the old time's sake, and um, Mm. on PC, there is 
one person in the Search and Destroy playlist. Yeah. <laughs> so we'd have to get on Xbox 360. Uh, so oh you're just God. like, did you just play guitar for that one guy over and over? No. Uh, so it said there was one guy in the playlist, so I went to go like try to find a match, and it wouldn't even create a match. So I had to go into Zombies, and I found one dude with a mic in Zombies, and I played for him for a little bit. Mm. And... Uh, there's there's some emulator mode where pe- there's a, a lot of people playing, um, but there's no game chat, so it's kind uh, of dude. I have a question lame. for you. I know you always talk about forced game chat, but like we've played in Call of Duty lobbies where there's just like a bunch of people talking. Mm-hmm. Why don't you just try and get on and like do like a team deathmatch where just there's just a group of people that are there. I have tried recent CODs and either I get muted right away or or some shit. Like I, I yeah. tried a couple CODs ago to do some guitar stuff. I don't remember which one it was, but I tried it on PC and it just no. It's like I don't know if people just don't have the patience for that kind of thing anymore. Or, but I think I got muted right away mm. every time. I think everybody wants to so. be in like some fucking org nowadays. Like since Fortnite popped off and like fifteen year olds yeah. started becoming millionaires off like. Winning tournaments and shit, and everybody gets on COD. Well, now there's like gonna be... a thousand more orgs too. It's fucking everything. Yeah. <clears throat> Name yeah, dot gg bullshit. Just, yeah. I could just get reactions so much faster on Omegle, and videos would do better. Yeah. People like, yeah. You know, they could see the faces of the people. So I just don't see the point in like torturing myself into like hours and hours of begging people to listen. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't think there is a point <laughs> to be honest. Yeah, well, we should play like just TDM <clears throat> on Black Ops Two or something, and just like do jokes, just for fun. Yeah, we could. Yeah, that emulator one's got lots of people playing it, so Hell it's kind of yeah. like, uh, kind of like uh, you join a, a server that people are like hosting. It's it's a little bit different. That'd be but... sick. I'm oh, is it like that. how uh, the original like COD Four Modern Warfare did their uh, servers, where they just like they had no dedicated servers? Everyone was like server listed on PC. Uh, yeah, I okay. think it's like that. <clears throat> that makes sense. How bad were the hackers though? Because I remember I tried playing World at War not that long ago, and like. You'd literally go in a lobby and everyone would just be sitting in one spot, spinning, killing the whole like map over and over. That's how it is on console. I don't know how it is on PC. Yay. On console, it's there is no normal lobby. I remember me. So oh, Soup was that you? I was playing Modern <laughs> Warfare Two with, and there was like a really yeah. hacked lobby. Mm-hmm. There was like a gun that was shooting like guided missiles. <laughs> you were just like dunk 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 dunk. Sounds about right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's just a USB mod. That's I think Modern Warfare boring. 2 was like one of the most hacked, like, all of these. Oh, like yeah. The worst one. Even when it was, like, the main COD, there was, yeah. like, hacking all the time. Like, I remember being so mad because I spent so long on that game trying to actually get every single title and emblem. And then I went into a lobby. It looked normal. Everything looked normal. Shot one guy and, like, yeah, the, the XP same thing on screen had like the letter E in it and like a bunch of backwards like Russian shit. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> and then I, I was I was like, oh fuck, there's a hack lobby. So I tried to leave and yeah, every every single thing was unlocked. You had everything unlocked. Yeah, yeah. I was so mad. That I happened was, to me as well. Yeah, I like wanted to stop playing after that, but yeah, it's just I just hate yeah. hackers. You should have uh turned your Xbox off. I think when you do that it it would like cancel out whatever. Because I remember like I would. I had a really good KD on like Black Ops One or something, and if I had like a really mm. bad game, I would just turn my Xbox off. And those, it was like the match never even counted. <laughs> you're so lame. <laughs> <laughs> when you're young like that, you care about your KD. That's like part of your. <laughs> it's like part of your personality. I used to care about my Black Ops yeah, KD. Too. Really? I never. I did. used to be fucking great at COD before I started sitting and spawning playing guitar for people. Me too. Yeah. Black Ops 2, I, I, I almost had like a 5.0 KD on Black Ops 2. I don't know why I was so good at that game. And yeah. After that, I'm like... Yeah, I was pretty good at that one, too. Yeah. After YouTube, my desire to be good at games just completely halted. Yeah, I have a select very small number of games that I desire to be good at. And oh, what you, are they? You played that... Uh, and Call of Duty is definitely not yeah, one I mean, of them. <laughs> any <laughs> FPS game, part. I don't care about being good at. I don't, yeah. I don't know. You used to care about Siege. Like... Yeah, Way for back a little bit. Day. When I first yeah, started I playing, yeah. Yeah. Like, I remember you actually wanted to be better at it. I don't know the last but game once I've I met actually a group of a people that, that I could actually laugh with and vibe with, and I was just like, I don't, I don't need to be decent at this anymore. I feel like it just makes shit less fun when you, like, care too much about it. Yeah. Like, mm-hmm. that goes with anything. Not even, like, a game or anything. Like, I know, like, for, like, hockey back in the day, I was, like, obviously played competitive and stuff. Um, so I cared about it a lot and I was pretty good at it, <clears throat> but like I used to get so mad that I would actually hate it because if I had a bad game or like 
whatever it was, uh, it would just be so unfun. And mm -hmm. I feel like the second yeah. I stopped like giving a fuck about it and just playing like non-competitive leagues and shit, it got so much more fun. Uh, yep. I feel like games are the same way. <clears throat> yeah, that's how uh, that's how Grizzly used to be. Like when we play Siege, every once in a while he'd have he'd like really get into the game, and then if he was like fucking up, then it would just like ruin his whole mood for the rest of the day. I'm like, yeah, I, I would he never still does want that, that with Warzone pretty pretty often, but he's working on it. We're trying to like convince him to just like play games to play them and laugh because that's what his mm -hmm. career is and not gameplay because right. nobody gives a fuck about any like, of our he's gameplay. Good at, he's good at games. He's definitely like. Far yeah. beyond our capabilities, but he just, uh, <clears throat> he's not going to be like fucking Kenny <laughs> S or like, he's, I ah, I was going to say that for a second. <laughs> well said. He's never going to be like fucking Shroud, you know? Nobody I have another question shroud. here if we want another one. Oh right, yeah, I forgot you even asked a question. All right. As a high schooler that has homecoming in the near future. Do you have any good high school dance stories slash any funny stories about asking someone to a dance or just a date in general? I've never uh, been to general? a dance ever. Really? Or do you have any top tier advice for when asking someone to dance, to a dance? Just um, ask it. I always just ask. went just with my current girlfriend. Yeah, I went so with I either. I had to go with like asking a random. I went Be with honest. girlfriend or ask. found woman there that was like. If you, you get know, rejected, sad, ask somebody funny. else. Ask yeah. the entire school at yeah. once. Don't be, be afraid efficient. to get rejected. It's fucking part of life. Steal oh, the yeah. fucking intercom from the principal and yell over the uh, fucking PA speakers. Go with your dad in ask. a wig. <laughs> <laughs> just a full bearded woman. After like the fiftieth rejection, seven. just go with your dad. <laughs> Put fake at boobs. That point, it's probably time. Put yeah. fake boobs yeah. on your dog and take him. <laughs> <laughs> All six of them. You gotta add fake boob for. <laughs> Can't have any of them normal titties sticking out. <laughs> I don't. I don't know if I have any. Actually, it wasn't my. Uh, it wasn't my prom. I think it was a prom. Yeah, it would have been a prom. It wasn't mine, but I went to one of my buddies' school's prom, uh, like after party things, and I was literally there for like fifteen minutes before the cops showed up because there was just like mass underage drinking, like. Literally, they had, like, a mm. giant keg outside. At a prom? At a prom uh, party. Like, mm. afterwards. Like, they're, you know, they have, like, prom, and then somebody will host, like, a prom party after or whatever. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, so there, it was, like, it was, like, too obvious. Like, they didn't care if you brought your own bottle and, like, pretended to hide it or whatever. But, like, there was, like, kegs and shit everywhere, and it was, like, very <laughs> obvious what was happening. Uh, so then the cops <sighs> got there, and as the cops got there, two guys started fighting. Um... And, and before they stopped it, one of them stabbed the other one and, like, tried running away. And he just got, like, tackled in front of everybody. And, like, there was, <laughs> there was a the lot fuck? of shit. Going. Yeah, he got, like, stabbed. Like, the dude got stabbed, like, right in the abdomen. And, uh, and then the guy ran away. And, uh, well, he didn't get very far considering the police were already there. And, uh, yeah, that was... That was that was something. Gee. Yeah, and then we went back... I ain't never had any shit like yeah, that. Yeah, and then we just went back to my friend's house and drank. And it was all good. <laughs> Holy what fuck. fuck. Yeah. <laughs> I have a party story like that, dude. I I uh, I got invited to a party with like this group of people that I, I kind of knew who they were, but they were like more like hardcore partiers than like me and my friends that I would hang out with. Yeah. And uh it was me and one of my close friends and we didn't really have anything else to do and I think everyone else was out of town. So we're like, yeah, we're going to go hang out with with these people tonight and see how this goes. And we kind of knew they were on, like, a little bit on the, uh, I don't know, Crazy just, like, side. different kind of, yeah, different side of things. And we pull up to this, like, house party. No fucking clue where I was. And uh, the yard is, like, full of vehicles where people are parking. So I just find a spot. And uh, we get out. And uh, we're there for, like, two minutes, maybe. Then some guy comes like we we had walked to the backyard. This guy comes like running from the front yard. He's like, "Yo, the lady next door says she's uh, calling the cops. That the cops are on the way because some dumbass just parked in their yard." And I was like, "Oh, fuck!" Was me. it you? Were you it the was dumbass, me, dude? I fucking <laughs> I parked in someone's yard, bro, and I didn't realize it was their yard. It was so dark. Like I didn't I didn't really know there was a house there, bro. And Damn. yeah, so like. And there were, like, drugs and fucking, I'm sure there was underage drinking and all that. Yeah. So everyone's, like, freaking the fuck out. And <laughs> so 
me and my friend look at each other and we're like, bro, we just fucked up. Everyone's like panicking and running around and like going to their cars to leave. It's fucking <laughs> chaos because of you. Dude, yeah, it's like, because there's a, you're like a yard full of people trying to leave now because the cops are on their way. <laughs> they scattering. Yeah. And I had parked like on top of a stump. So, <laughs> what yeah, I, listen, dude, I was like, I fucked up, all right? I, I parked on top of a stump or something in their yard. And I was like spinning tires because I was like stuck on top of the stump. Did so you not tear the fuck out of your car? No, like, it was what? fine. It was fine. So I, I like I finally got out of there, but everyone else had left. And as we're leaving, there was a car like flipped over in the ditch. <laughs> what? Oh my god! What <laughs> like what you <laughs> do? <laughs> you need somebody Bro. die. Yeah. That's so fucked. So we. <laughs> Yeah. So I probably, <laughs> I probably had someone that was fucked up at the party, flip <laughs> up their car in a ditch. <laughs> That's so fucked. Uh, you have blood on your hands. Yeah. I do. Yeah. You are fully responsible for that person's life. So answering the high school dance question, life is meaningless. Ask who you want to. If you get rejected, so fucking what? Go to the next person. If you get rejected, flip it. <clears throat> it's so hard to convince, like people of that age to believe that though you know what i mean yeah you no matter how much you say like be brave ask yeah. out it's not like oh okay my anxiety's gone yeah, now i'm just, just gonna be yeah, yeah just, because you're that age your whole world is like school but yeah because you, know? you never about you, don't, right. you don't know the and outside you feel world like yeah you feel like that rejection's gonna like carry with you the rest uh -huh. of your life when in reality like a year later you're it gonna is not even remember it is it hilarious happened. how little anything to do with high school mattered like i'm glad I'm so glad I didn't give a fuck about like anything in high school. Like I didn't like, I like I I made sure like my grades were fine and I wasn't like flunking out or anything. But I never like went like full sweaty and like would never hang out with my friends cuz I was busy like trying AP to make sure, calculus like, and shit. Yeah, like I I'm, I took fucking I, I think I took AP calculus set. No, I didn't take AP. I think I took like calculus though. That shit was awful. Yeah, we had uh I forget. I don't I don't know if ours is called AP as well. I can't even remember what it was called. But I did like one of the harder physics one, and I I I hated it. There was just like, like I like physics and I understand physics it, so it wasn't suck bad. A dick. I like it. It's like more physics is fun, now. but it's hard. I don't know. It was just easier for me to visualize. Like a but cow like, wiener. I just I just regretted it because like I, you actually had to put a little bit of work in, whereas every other class I just like show up, take a nap, and then go smoke weed in a porta potty with my friends. You know, it's just Ugh. like. This is a better life. <laughs> Couldn't find a better place to smoke weed. <laughs> yeah, that sounds like a great life. <laughs> smoke weed while it smells like shit and piss. <laughs> yeah. Nothing better than some shit and piss. <laughs> yeah, I yeah, used to party a lot, but I don't, I don't think I have any like good party stories, to be honest. There's uh, there's one that, that we probably should have got a lot of trouble in, but, but for some reason we didn't. Uh... So my friend had this little, it was really fucking funny. He had like this little tiny house and like his neighborhood used to be all little houses. And it was like, it, it got like gentrified as fuck. And there was these massive houses next to him on both sides. And he just still had this little dinky ass house. But uh, he used to always host parties like every weekend or something. And I don't remember why we had fireworks, but we had fireworks for some reason. Like little like Roman candles and shit. And we were firing them at each other as dumbass high schoolers do. Um, one kid's sweater caught on fire from it. That was that was something. That, well, that that's was his a, fault for wearing a sweater. Yeah, that's what it was like a knit yeah. sweater. It's just like, yeah, you're you're gonna die if you're playing with a Roman candle. But uh yeah, so my one friend went to shoot it at at our other buddy, completely fucking missed, smashed through this dude's fucking window, blows up in oh. his kitchen. His fucking fire alarm's going off, like the smoke alarm. He runs out, is absolutely fucking losing his shit, screaming. We all just ran inside, like, you know, pretending that nothing happened. And uh, he came over, knocked on the door, asked who did it, asked what the fuck happened. My friend fessed up to it, explained. And he's like, okay, we're going to go 50-50 on repairing the window, and you guys can't use fireworks at the house anymore. And like, deal. And that was, that was it. He, uh... He definitely could have called the cops, like press charges and shit. Yeah. Because a firework went off in his fucking home. But uh, yeah, it was, it was all, <laughs> it was all good. Nothing too bad came from it. But yeah, there was uh, there was, I, don't I know, wish there was a, a lot firework of fuck would shit go there. off in my home. You you can do that, you know. You, you Every like, once in a while, just keep everyone on their toes, you know. 
Just like a let timed, fucking, a timed let my trigger. My fucking cat know who's boss sometimes. <laughs> With explosives. Yeah, yeah dude. <laughs> Keep him on his old toes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, yeah, let's see. I got another question here. Oh, I know. The Mario the, movie. Oh, we I meant to ask about you Mario about that. Oh, yeah, dude. Yeah, baby. Yeah, how do we uh, how do we feel about I that cast? I am so fucking I excited. Wait. I'm pissing and shitting. I both am of my so nuts. excited. I, I feel dude. like it's going to be a good time. I'm, I'm very yeah, much yeah. looking uh, forward to that horse. Is it live? I want it, I I want want it to be rated to R. I want it to be rated R. Like that yeah. would be hilarious. They need like somebody I like want them to be like it's a me Marlo motherfucker. They need like James Gunn to direct that. They need somebody like out of pocket to direct <laughs> that shit. Like Quentin Tarantino directing just the Mario obscene movie. Just gore and violence <laughs> and just entrails. Just smashing a, a, a Goomba skull. And is it blood a, and guts is, is it is it going to be live action or is it? No, it's, it's animated. animated. Okay. It's okay. made by the same people who made uh, Despicable Me. Oh my god! No oh. way. Yeah. Hope there's a illumination. Yeah, I hope so as well. Dude, I'm so excited. How do you the feel about that amazing. cast? Dude. I'm, dude, it's perfect. Dude, it's got Chris everything Pratt. But, so everything cool. but Chris Pratt. I'm down for it. Chris Pratt's a fucking dude, chud. Dude, I love, I love Chris Pratt. He's I fucking such a love chud. Him. He's hilarious. Dude, dude his, yeah, Instagram, cool his Instagram video, like, he was talking about it, and he was like, it's a me, Mario. It's a me, And he's Mario. like, that's not <laughs> that's not the voice. That's not the voice. Like, <laughs> <laughs> All the Jack Black is oh, yeah, that, that, dude, that yeah, literally could fuck? not that Perfect could not have been casting. yeah a, a better actor for for Bowser. When Even, I first yeah, yeah. when I first saw that on Twitter, Rogan I didn't know it was animated. Kong. I thought it was gonna be like live action. <laughs> I was mm -mm. like, wait, <laughs> this is gonna be kind of weird. <laughs> live action <laughs> looked like some gay like porno. Yeah, that's what I was saying. <laughs> it's just like I feel like it looked like a low budget porn if it wasn't animated. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> like the porn we all watch together in Discord. That one. Uh huh. Oh, that man! When Toad got real. <laughs> was it Toad? I thought it was Bowser that got real. Or was it? Was it? Yeah, oh, it was yeah. Bowsette that yeah, got Yeah, and then real. there was this messed up Toad watching. That's yeah. what it was. Yeah. yeah. Dude, Keegan Michael uh, Key is Toad. Yeah, that's gonna that, be dude, so. Dude, like oh, what? Yeah. The the whole cast is just. It's gonna be hilarious. I feel it's like it's gonna be a big Toad shit with post. a black guy voice is gonna be yeah. something <laughs> to behold. It's a dude. It's <laughs> like it's gonna be so expensive for this movie. It's gonna be like the biggest shit post. But I think that's what they want. <laughs> yeah, they because like, the more it gets memed, the more they, <laughs> they, the more they profit. Like yeah, they. That's right, the yeah, thing. Yeah. Like they know what the fuck. Bro, they had Seth Rogen as Donkey Kong. They know what they're doing. <laughs> I just hope he does his little Seth Rogen I, laugh as a giant ape. I'm just kind of mad that I wasn't asked to be Donkey Kong. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> yeah, you are the monkey I'm man. a little upset, but it'll be all right. Yeah, Maybe in the future. Yeah, they're, that's the only they're lost. That's the only let down on the casting. <laughs> Dude, imagine you see Donkey Kong. It's like, hey there, little lady. Or <laughs> some <laughs> shit. <laughs> it's motherfucking monkey man. Her it's her in Donkey half. Kong. Mm. Yeah, I don't know. I'm I'm looking forward yeah. to. When's it even come out? Is it like in the middle of filming or is December twenty first, twenty twenty two? Oh, okay. So we got a bit, a whole fucking year, a whole baby. year. We need to all go to the red carpet, dude. Yeah. I honestly, I, I honestly was meant like I wanted to ask you guys about that. Can we somehow use our connections? Yes, I won't Let's try. I will be there for the red carpet Hollywood premiere bullshit. Okay, we'll we'll movie. make we'll make yeah. we'll make it happen, soup. Can we, Let's dude? Can we please make it happen? I, yeah. I would love to do that. We'll make it happen. Oh, we'll reach out to everyone we know. Let's make it happen, dude. I will please. literally text Obama once the podcast is done. <laughs> and I will make it happen for us, Soup. I'm gonna email Jack Black right now. <laughs> he does have a YouTube channel. You can just leave him a comment. That actually might not be that unobtainable, to be honest. I don't know. I, I feel we like should, it, we should actually try. I feel like if, if any of them happen. we could get in contact with, it'd be Jack Black. Yeah. Well, let's all fucking try that. Let's use our our somewhat YouTube fucking status to get red carpet to the Mario movie. <laughs> it's the only thing we've ever asked Dude, for. Dude, please. please. No one. free cars, nothing crazy. We just want to go to the Mario I don't want a Lamborghini. I don't want <laughs> fucking take my whole paycheck for the month. Get me fucking Mario access, baby. I'd sacrifice one month's pay for it for Red Yeah, Dude, I'd so, probably do that. Honestly, I would as well. I mean, at that and point, just, just, we could just probably buy our way in, I would think. I'd be willing to pay. If we had to pay, I'd be... Dude, I'd be willing to yeah. pay. 
Name the price, Nintendo movie. <laughs> we'll pay it. I'm some, excited for Nintendo World. Some deep pockets for the Mario movie. Oh, but true. Sleeps on we gotta it. go there, too. Dude, you sleep on a shit mattress, but are I not- spend money on experiences, <laughs> deep Blark. Deep pockets for the Mario film. <laughs> I spend money on experiences. He knows sleep, his priorities. Fuck out of that, Mario. Yeah. That, that, nobody cares about that. He anymore. knows his priorities. That is fucking That's hilarious. That's right. Gambling, Mario movie, I'll splurge. <laughs> <laughs> that that could be the whole weekend. We could just gamble and then watch the Mario film. Oh, dude, that honestly, I could not like pick a better. Yeah, I feel vacation. like if I had like Goons two days trip, left of yeah. life, that's what I'd want it to be. We could <laughs> we could honestly make it a business expense too. We could just do a podcast in person. You could make everything a business something. expense and then write everything off. Mm-hmm. Oh. Can you write off vicious gambling in Las Vegas if you go with the YouTube <laughs> boys? Yeah. <laughs> If it's for a vlog. Really? Although I don't think you can film in casinos. But no, you can still, you know, part of the vlog. You can say it's there. I wonder, I actually wonder that. Like, could I just go gamble like a hundred grand and then be like, yeah, tax write-off. Like, is that a thing? Mm, uh, I don't know about that. I mean, I'm asking, I'm asking three know. non-qualified accountants. So, I don't know. I evade my taxes in general, so you probably don't want to ask. Okay, tax evasion is, is really awesome. It's a, definitely a good thing. <laughs> Everyone yeah, should you practice. Wanna have, you want to put some extra inches on your dick? Evade taxes. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I, I don't. But I'm being I don't serious about this. the Mario movie. Yeah. We, yeah, you, yeah, you uh, do, Blur. Yeah, yeah, for real. No. Yes. No. I will go to the red carpet for the Mario movie. I'll do whatever it takes. Okay. Next question. Same. I'll. Yeah. Mister Goons, people, yeah. I have a question. If you were to die and be reincarnated as any known living animal in the world. Which animal would you like to become after dying? A cum. Squirrel. <laughs> Gorilla, definitely. We had this cum. Oh, we, we did this a long time ago. Did we? said he was going to be a Neat. squirrel. We all laughed at him. A flying squirrel would be sick, dude. Fuck off. You know, they Why don't, don't actually fly, like right? They just, they just glide. They glide. Yeah. Just Gliding become an airplane, squirrel. dumbass. Well, well you, it, with the day that they figure out how to flap their little arms, it's over for everyone. There are no birds like, anymore. They're all government spies with cameras and microphones inside mm-hmm. of them. That is true. And when they poop on your car, they're putting a tracking device from the mm-hmm. government on your car. Yes. yes. I actually just wiped off like nine bird turds. You're getting right watched, Arab. Podcast. The government's mad. <laughs> government's mad. Yeah. I, I don't know what I did except for be brown, kind of. You better watch yourself, <laughs> yeah, Arab boy. I guess that's enough, isn't it? <gasps> you qualify for the, the, the list. Qualify for a lisp. Thanks. You quack sometimes. I really don't. But when no one's listening on. Do we have another question? Yeah. I would like to uh, segue off I, my quacking. Let's play Would You Rather for the outro. Okay, let's play Would Who You Rather. Who has a good Would You Rather? Would you rather would or would you rather would? Okay, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'll Google them. I'll even uh, no, come up with them off the top of your head. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Would you rather shit right now. come or come shit? Rather... <laughs> we talked about that last night. You can't do that. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay. All right. Man. Um, oh, these are all fucking stupid. Would you rather have to unscrew your anus every time you poo poo? Or would you rather throw up every time you breathe? I'd rather unscrew, unscrew my anus. ass. Unscrew my anus. You literally breathe twenty four seven. You would just you would die. What kind of a would you rather is that? <laughs> would you rather take a horrible scenario or a, a slightly annoying scenario? I mean, that's not even that annoying. Like it'd be like a toothpaste lid. Like nothing's coming out unless you unscrew it, right? That's yeah. like old people proof. Just a screw on ass. Would you rather be the most gorgeous person in a? In the most third world country, or be the ugliest celebrity? Probably the mm, ugliest definitely celebrity. Definitely the because, ugliest yeah. celebrity. Yeah. I feel like that'd have to be a pretty shallow answer to want to be just pretty but have nothing. Be- <laughs> like, I yeah. I don't, I will do anything to not be ugly. Pretty have will, nothing, ugly have money. I will eat money. dirt. Yeah, I'd rather be ugly with money because then women are still attracted to you. 
Well, yep. see, if you were an ugly celebrity, you could just be extremely funny. Yeah, yeah true. that's. But that's also it's you know own, what Steve Buscemi is all about. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Jesus Christ! Jesus. You could just be self-aware <laughs> and be like, "Oh, look at me! I'm ugly! Ha ha! I'm ugly!" Ten million. And everyone would check. love you. Yeah, everyone would love you. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck is it? I I looked up. I googled some. <laughs> would you rather questions? What is this one? Would you rather have a baby vomit on you or would you rather vomit on a baby? Definitely vomit I'm on a baby. I'm 100% vomiting all over that baby. <laughs> I'm waterboarding that bitch. I'd, I'll, that. I'll do that for fun. Bro, he, yeah. he won't even remember it. Why Why would I let vomit be on me? Little I'm gonna, fucking bitch. Bro, I'm going to throw up on you, little uh, bitch. Oh, fucking baby I'm bird. i you like a bird. Yeah, all baby bird. An entire... Yeah, you better up. get breast fed, fed by my old fucking chicken noodle soup, bitch. It's half digested, motherfucker. Fuck you, bitch. Oh, dude, this one actually out. sounds ass. Would you rather use boiling water as eye drops or gargle with hot sauce? Oh my god, gargle those... with hot sauce. I, I don't, I don't. Which one's gonna do less? What? Boiling damage? water in your eyeball? Oh, it's just an eye drop. It's one drop. I don't know which one's gonna do less damage to you overall. Like hot sauce is, is okay. Is, yeah, that is kind of tough. Pretty, actually. pretty bad for for your body. What about hot sauce eye drop that's boiling? <laughs> that, that's worse than <laughs> all is of that. that. The only option. So combine what them about together. Gargling boiled water. <laughs> uh, that, yeah, that, that hurts that's, so that's, bad. Yeah, that would not feel good. <laughs> Dude, these what about are gargling, about gargling baby vomit. <laughs> oh. Would you rather be a tissue paper or toilet paper? So either are you getting cummed on or shit on? Uh, or boogers. Or boogers. I'd rather be a tissue because you have more of a chance of it being boogers than cum. Yeah. <laughs> Instead of just yeah. straight okay, up what shit. Okay, what about a dorm room tissue? It's like a 90-10 split that it's going to be cum. Yeah, but isn't it always better to be cummed on than shit on? Well, not in my case. I like to be shit on. But like for the average person. I don't, I like I'd probably, pose, I'd probably rather get cummed on, yeah. Yeah. That's going to be taken out of context yeah, At least somewhere. the cum won't stink. I don't know, man. I feel like... Uh, cum be stinky. I feel like cum could definitely smell if you left it. <clears throat> like, if you oh, yeah, are... if you, But if you are a napkin and you get cummed on, that's that's your whole life. You are literally permanently cum napkin. See, you got to think about it long term, though, because eventually you're going to be in the ocean, like, getting... There's no way that dolphin. dried cum... Smells worse than dried shit. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Dried there, there turd no stops smelling. This, really, you have to like. Yeah, but either way, you end up in the. Yeah, ocean. but you have to like. Yeah. You have to like resaturate a turd like an MRE for it to smell again. Like if it's dry out, it doesn't smell like anything. I feel like I don't know what dry. I've never I've never left the napkin out with dried cum on it to see what it smells how like. How many? How many days a week do you resaturate your turd? Like, why do you know this? <laughs> I don't know. You've just like never walked like by like a turd and it doesn't smell. And then if you walk by that same turd, like a dog turd, if it rained, it smells like shit again. I've never had any pets. Oh, okay. So well, yeah. I wouldn't, I wouldn't know. Okay. Yeah. I'm allergic to my, everything that has when my hairs. dog Kill was animals. A, when my dog was an old piece of fucking shit, he would like start crapping. Is that cheese dog? Yeah. He'd start crapping on the deck instead of going down. Uh, all the way to the uh, bottom. So, like, I'd walk out, and, bitch. like, if it was hot out, it would just be, like, this little crusty nugget on the deck. Um, and if I didn't if uh, I didn't clean it off, it wouldn't smell. But then if it rained or something, God, it was, it uh, was tough. So, tough not to eat it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's, yeah, exactly. Yeah, 100%. Would you right. rather be the do or McNasty? Uh, the do. <laughs> I think I'd rather stay myself. I don't think I want to be Why? either of them. <laughs> he makes a shit ton of money, and he's skinny and fit. And um... you know, there's nothing preventing you from doing any of those things, right? Like, you are the yeah. These are you are the things. only thing preventing all of that. Okay, tomorrow I make Omega video, <laughs> <laughs> or just upload more of what you do now, or just what's up, dog. What? Yeah. What? What? Mm-hmm. I think you we're past me. the hour mark, which means skedaddle. Yeah. <laughs> which means skid mark sandwich tuna Tuesdays. 
I think we're actually a minute away. I think we're like almost nine minutes in before we actually started the podcast. Unless I'm wrong. I don't know. I might have started my I think you're wrong. real early. Okay. See? One more would okay. you rather. Yeah. Uh, I don't have another. Uh, Blarg, would you rather be an ISIS or the Taliban? <laughs> I'm not answering that. Taliban. Would you rather be an ISIS or the Taliban? Taliban, Taliban, Cinnabon. Would you rather work for the Taliban or Cinnabon? <laughs> Tell me right now. <laughs> well, Taliban, easily. I'd be fat if I worked for Cinnabon. It smells too good. Mm, so I much can't, cinnamon in the beer. I can't imagine the <laughs> Taliban <laughs> smells <laughs> too great. Dude, every time I go to the mall, it, it is a war with myself to not get Cinnabon. I haven't had it since I was like 15. Reward yourself and do it. But that would... Uh, no. Reward yourself and do it. It, it, it literally will backtrack me like four days of like to health. every temptation. That's a horrible idea. I'm leaving now. No, you're not. Goodbye. No. What do you mean, no? No. What are you going to do? Hold like my us, paycheck subscribe. from me? Fuck off. I'll leave when I want. I'm going to hold your on, hand. Download on Spotify. Well, that, that sounds nice. Like, subscribe, download on Spotify. Please download on Spotify. Long up. Long up. Okay, goodbye. Somebody commented on that video. Everyone, leave us some questions and right. thanks for listening. And oh, we're have still a nice going. Day. Okay, well, soup can still do that. Have a nice day, everybody. Okay. Thank yep. you for listening. Download on Spotify. Piss your fans.